called The Ring of Truth. So I'll be reading out the top celebrity fact, and the panellists, in turn, will dissect, discuss, and finally deduce whether or not that fact has about it the ring of truth or the stench of deceit. So, your teaser. To <laughs> coincide with the US version of The Weakest Link, uh, Ben & Jerry released a limited edition and Robinson-flavoured ice cream. An ice cream that tastes solely of bile and remorse. I, I can't <laughs> see that. Not so. It sold out in two weeks. Very popular. When you open the tin, was the surface of it really taut in an unnatural kind of way? Because <laughs> you couldn't possibly break into the ice cream beneath. She's doing that thing in the photo, that wink thing, isn't she, which always unnerves me, because she does it at the end of the weakest link to sort of say, you know, like, it's She's all a gonna... joke, I'm not really evil. But that's the bit that scares the crap out of me. And the thing is, though, that, that wink is the only thing that she used to do that on points of view as well and she's sort of trying to say that she's in some way being consistent well, ah. in points of view she didn't read out the people's letters and then just say you know f off <laughs> but she does to the answers of the nice people on the weakest link who are trying to win a quiz do you think when you open the ice cream it just has, it has written on top use a proper spoon dickhead yeah. <laughs> there are precedents Right. Uh, well, they, they've made the Desperate person. Housewives editions uh, called Cherry Hatcher. So what was the Anne Robinson one called? Uh, ginger Ice Queen. <laughs> oh. Ginger Ice Queen's really nice. It's so, gonna, yeah, it's gonna taste like of ginger, ginger, not of that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> uh, ginger is a recognised pleasant flavour. She's a recognised asshole. <laughs> No, that's, that's totally different. That's you know, it's delicate. just people who, can, who like ginger enough to be able to stomach the sight of her face while they eat it. Now, I can right. believe that those people exist. So that suddenly has become a lot more plausible. What? Suddenly you're saying that ice cream, ice cream, the flavour of a woman who's undergone loads of surgeries, obsessed with money, and for some reason considers herself witty. No, no, no. Ginger ice cream with a picture of that bitch. Yes. <laughs> Next week, when Anne Robinson is our guest, you'll be on Lee's team. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Anne. I like Anne. I, we went for a meal with Anne Robinson, do you remember? Yes. It was a, it was a BBC meal. And she came up to me and she went, Are you a scheduler? And I thought, No, I'm going to go. And she went, Yeah, I am. Well, why have you rescheduled my show? And I went, Well, Anne thought I was going to go along with it. It's because she actually thinks I'm scheduling shows. So I said, Because it's not very good. <laughs> I mean, it's no good. It needs to be on later, isn't it? It's absolutely rubbish, Anne. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Is that how she really talks? She talks like yeah. that. <laughs> she was going like, can I have more wine? <laughs> it's not real. It's, I'm a pretend evil witch. <laughs> what are we thinking? I think it's true. I think it's true, Jimmy. Oh, Rika? Yeah. Okay. It's true. Okay, we'll go for true. Okay, they're saying it's true. David, your verdict. It all boils down to this. Would you nibble her or not? Well, I mean, I said he wouldn't, as, no. as I think <laughs> I made. <mean. laughs> uh, neither metaphorically nor... In real life, oh, I'm actually going to be sick. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it's true. Uh, I don't think it's true. No. Okay, we're going to say it's a lie. And you'd be absolutely right. It is a lie. <laughs> it's complete rubbish. <laughs> yes, uh, Ben and Jerry did not manufacture an Anne Robinson flavoured ice cream, although the plan had been to freeze the ingredients by holding them next to Anne Robinson's heart. <laughs> <laughs> so.